Chapter 35 At the Star Theatre Part 2 Sunday December 14 1884 Sri Ramakrishna arrived at the Star Theatre on Bidon Street in Calcutta to see a play about the life of Prahlad M Baburam Narayan and the other devotees were with him The hall was brightly lighted The play had not yet begun The master was seated in a box talking with Girish Master smiling Ah You have written nice plays. Girish. But sir, how little I assimilate. I just write. Master. No. You assimilate a great deal. The other day I said to you that no one could sketch a divine character unless he had love of god in his heart yes one needs to assimilate spiritual ideas i went to keshav's house to see the play nobo brindabon i saw a deputy magistrate there who earned 800 rupees a month everyone said that he was very learned man but i found him restless because of a boy his son he was very anxious to find a good seat for the boy he paid no attention to the spiritual conversation of the players the boy was pestering him with questions father what is this what is that he was extremely busy with the boy you see he merely read books but he didn't assimilate their ideas girish I often ask myself why bother about the theatre anymore master no no let things be as they are people will learn much from your plays the performance began pehlad was seen entering the school room as a student at the sight of him sri ramakrishna uttered once or twice the word prahlad and went into samadhi during another scene sri ramakrishna wept to see prahlad under an elephant's feet he cried when the boy was thrown into the fire the scene changed lakshmi and narayan were seen seated in golok narayan was worried about prahlad this scene too threw sri ramakrishna into an ecstatic mood after the performance girish conducted sri ramakrishna to his private room in the theater He said to the master Would you care to see the farce Bibaho Bibhrato or The Confusion of Marriage Master Oh no Why something like that after the life of Prahlad 
I once said to a leader of a theatrical troupe. End your performance with some religious talk. We have been listening to such wonderful spiritual conversation. And now to see the confusion of marriage, a worldly topic. We should become our old selves again. We should return to our old mood. 